Let's talk about psych ward designs that just make sense. So most psych wards have metal hand sanitizers that are encased, and that's because we don't want people to be able to punch open the hand sanitizers and have access to the alcohol within them. And that's because some people go through alcohol withdrawal when they enter the psych ward, and there's unfortunately been people who either drink the hand sanitizer or they'll even put it in their rectum so that the alcohol can be absorbed into their GI tract and they can get intoxicated. Very sad, but we prevent that through these metal things. A lot of psych wards also give these socks with these little rubber grips on them and we have people change into these disposable scrubs and the rubber grips are so people don't slip and we don't want people to have shoelaces so they can't hang themselves. We avoid using these kind of doorknobs because we don't want people to be able to hold us out of the room or like I said, hang themselves with something. So instead we have these kind of doors that are designed at a slant and are harder to grip so you can't hold someone out of a room. Same thing with the bathroom. There's a slant at the doorway and then there's no bars right here. 